We are here with the Elmira College women's ice hockey team from left to right. We have Keanu Melvin, head coach Tim Crowley, and Jess Adams following a 5-3 win over Manhattanville College in the UCHC title game. Um, general question for any and all of you, uh, what's it like to three-peat? <laughs> um, well, I've been here freshman, sophomore, uh, junior year, so I was kind of introduced to the UCHC, and it feels nice that uh, roles have changed, but it's really great to be a part of it all three years. How about being fitted for a sombrero? <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Talk about those three goals. Can you can you recall them? Yeah, um, it's all 26 of us. So, I mean, I do what I could to finish it, but it comes from D zone goalie at all of us. It's not just my goals, it's everyone's. Kiana, talk about coming from behind. I've chatted with you through the course of the years and with you, Tim, about this group being a, a first period, third period team. Yeah. <laughs> so first period, obviously, you all came up empty at that point. Yeah. Absolutely. What was it like to come from behind to win this game? Um, you know, we like to keep it interesting for our fans out there, but it always feels good to come from behind. Um, I didn't have a doubt in my mind at all that we weren't going to be able to come back. Um, our team really pulled it together, responded together, and the energy really carried out to the ice. Yeah, what, what was the mindset there when, um, you know, Manhattanville went up 3-1 and then, uh, you know, you get that power play goal, key goal right before heading into that intermission? You know, what was what was the mindset right as that goal scored and what was the mood like in the locker room? Um, obviously, it's good to end the period with a goal like that. It really changes the mood on the ice, brings energy into the locker room, especially at the end of the period. Um, we went to the locker room said this is not like we're not losing this game we're winning this game this is our game this is our rank we don't lose in this rank tim looking ahead you've won the conference it's an automatic bid uh, some thoughts at this point yeah i mean I, I think for us you know just how we won this weekend you know i'm really proud of the group and how we responded and you know we we played a way that you need to win in playoffs. You know, for us, like grinding out and responding when they went up, and we pushed back whenever they pushed us. So, you know, our the staff, me, Mandy, and Aaron, we're really proud of them, and um, you know, they deserved today and deserved kind of having that experience. And you know, for us, it, it's something where it's become a standard of our program, right? And uh, you know, we're excited about whether we're playing, uh, you know, on Wednesday or Saturday, no matter what, you know, I, I believe in the group, I understand, you know, what type of talent and people we have in that locker room, and it just goes to show how we won today, you know, going down two goals in your, in your own rink, like Key kind of mentioned, and just how calm the bench was and how calm our room was, and, and they, at, we have a group, you know, and, and Key being one of them, uh, you know, we've been through a lot, whether it's, you know, getting to the final four and responding, being down two goals, it, it's just kind of carried throughout, and, and uh, it ripples through our locker room. Are you handy with hammer and nails because with all the hardware this group has collected yeah. in the last week, you probably will have to add a new wing on at the Dome. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're happy with the group. Um, kind of like what Jess said, um, you know, at the end of the day, it's, it's a group of 26 that accomplished that, not just a couple individuals. And, you know, today we got uh, contributions from throughout our lineup, whether it was, you know, Claire Meter's line who provided some energy and a couple nice plays for us or you know, some freshmen stepping up in big roles. And then obviously our upperclassmen, who I thought, um, you know, really carried us in that third and, and people who you know, have been playing really good for us and really kind of took us, um, you know, and, and were able to win that game today.